it is Saturday and it's nine o'clock Saturday no I think it's Sunday yeah it's Sunday and it's nine o'clock in the morning um I thought that it would be kind of fun to do a little morning vlog it might turn into like a little day vlog but that's okay um, I'm just gonna do my skincare right now. I have time to do a workout and shower, but I just didn't really plan my morning like that. And I don't know if I'm cutting it close because I have to go get my phone fixed at Verizon. It like currently won't take pictures and like I can't call the microphone is broken. So I'm gonna go get that fixed. So I got the Final Cut Pro like trial. I, I edited my last video on that and I'm editing my um today's video on it and like all my videos will be edited on there from now on so hopefully it'll be like cool like better quality but i'm not sure so i'm gonna start off with my cleanser the milky jelly cleanser i'm not gonna show all the products that i've showed like a million times i'm just gonna show like the newer ones or the ones that i'm loving today's a shower day so i shower once every two days that's why my hair is so greasy but i'm trying to train my hair to be less greasy well i shower every day but i wash my hair once every two days so i do a couple other things like i do a mask and i exfoliate and stuff like that um on these days so i'll show you what i use for that but i'm just gonna cleanse I've been trying to simplify my skincare routine because I've gone through phases like re recently I wanted to be um, less is more because I heard that was like better for your skin but I used to like be like oh I want like an essence and a double cleanse and then a hydrating serum and a vitamin C serum and a refining serum and I just like I don't really need all that stuff on my skin. I'm going to get rid of all my serums except for my vitamin C serum. Um, because I just don't think it's necessary. Uh, right now I'm just using a hyaluronic acid and a vitamin C serum. And then I was going to buy um, the Glossier Super Pure for the nighttime. But I don't know. I have done a lot of research on skincare and I listened to like... A lot of podcasts and stuff and a lot of people say that less is more and that um, you don't really need all these things unless your skin like has specific concerns and so I'm just doing the bare minimal um, skincare approach because I feel like once I start doing that my skin might actually clear up <laughs> I feel like I haven't vlogged in a while like oh what is this like? I like to use a jade roller in the morning. It helps with lymphatic draining. Um, it makes your face like less puffy. I used to do it in the morning and the night, but I think I'm just gonna use it in the morning now. I wanna film like a, I don't know. I feel like this, I kind of do skincare videos like this all the time, but I feel like it would be kind of cool to do like a Vogue um, video. Like, on my channel, obviously, not on Vogue. <laughs> but if it was, like, one of those... I don't know if you've seen them, but I love when Vogue does, like, those skincare or, like, makeup look like videos. Okay, why is my face so white? I, like, mess up my camera. Oh, okay. Now I'm just doing eye cream. I used to love the Clinique Popstar eye cream. That's what I have. This is, like, the first eye cream that I bought a full bottle of. But although I do love like everything about it, I just don't love, like I don't see any results at all. So I was like, I'm probably not going to use it anymore just because nothing's happening. So I used to, this is the difference in my skincare routine since last time. I used to use a moisturizer and a, an SPF, which I decided to stop doing because I just didn't think it was necessary as long as you put enough SPF moisturizer like on like obviously if I'm going to the beach or if it's summer or something and I'm gonna like go outside for a long time um even in the winter maybe and it's like sunny I will put more like I'll put on SPF but I don't think it needs to be done every single day if I'm just gonna sit in my house 
you're supposed to treat your neck as like an extension not an extension of your face but as a different part so i used to like just bring my products down but you're supposed to do so on here and some on here um which i'm trying to do more i'm gonna do face oil what i want my smaller skincare routine to be i will definitely keep you guys updated but um i want it to just be cleanser vitamin c eye cream moisturizer and oil which is still a couple steps but it's not overdoing it i feel like i like how the future do makes my face look like glowy you can't really tell because the lighting in here is really bad but i like how it makes my face look like that i just don't like the smell or like the consistency of future do okay i know that i put this on for skincare but i kind of like it I don't so now after skincare i always put on chapstick this is my spf chapstick i do that in the morning the one is the pacifica one and it leads like little beads on your lips and it also like makes your lips white which i hate um now i'm going to exfoliate my hands I love this exfoliator. I talked about it before. It's the Hand in Hand Eucalyptus and Sea Salt um, Sugar Serum. Oh, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I stopped using toner. The toner that I was using, I absolutely hated, but I was like, oh, I'll just use it out until it's done, and then I'll buy some more. But I don't, I just didn't like toner that much. Okay, now I'm going to use my hand cream. I love this one. It's the Simple Pleasures Fala La Vanilla <laughs> Icing Scented Hand Cream. But, um, I can't find it anywhere because it's, like, a seasonal thing. And I think it came out in, like, 2016 or something. But it just smells so good and it makes my hands feel really soft. I think I'm going to do some mascara today. Just because I'm going to, like, Verizon and stuff. But I normally don't really do makeup that often. Yesterday I did a full face because I went to lunch at Christina's parents' house. But today I'm just doing mascara. Another thing I want to put in my skincare routine is a lash serum. Because I feel like if I just had super long lashes, which I already feel like my lashes are pretty long um but if they were like a little bit longer and like fuller then i probably wouldn't even need to put on mascara and that would be a great feeling i used to wear this bracelet like every day and i started wearing it again it's my it's from like swavorsky or something that like swan brand but it's really pretty it just has little silver ba balls and since my cape bracelet is also silver um it like matches and it's really pretty this is what i'm wearing this headband from, like, I don't know, <laughs> my necklace from Altered State. This shirt is Tommy Hilfiger, but I bought it at Pack Sun. I can try to have it linked. And then these are my Lululemons. This is the outfit. I wish I did a workout this morning. I have so much time and I could have showered, but I'll just do it later. Yesterday, I, like, did mine at, like, literally 11 o'clock at night. It was kind of weird. Um, but I've been into doing Sammy Clark or what is it? So Triangle on Instagram, like the bikini, um, brand, like their Instagram, they have like an IGTV where they have like workout people like do workout videos for their channel. And I've been doing those videos and they're really good. Actually, I've been doing, it has Sammy Clark on it and then Lindsay Heron. And I had like one other girl, but I didn't really like her. And she only did like one video. So I've been doing those. So I'm reading this book. It's called If I Stay. I don't know if I've talked about it. But I've been reading it for my book club and it's like really 
sad and I don't really love it that much, but I'm this far through and we were supposed to have our meeting today, but I said I couldn't go because I can't. And it's good because it's like kind of rainy today anyways, and it was gonna be an outdoor meeting. What I've been eating for breakfast every day is a banana. It's really yummy and easy, like for a school day. I can just grab it. Can you please like mute this or something? So I normally eat at like 9.30 or 10 or 10.30, somewhere in between that time frame. And um, this is like really easy to grab in between classes and just like eat. And I'm going to drink some kombucha. I have been really into kombucha. I just haven't drank it in a while. It's the Health Aid kombucha. My favorite is the G... It's like the Synergy one. Um, I think that's what it's called. But this is my second favorite one. And they didn't have Synergy at Wegmans. So this is the pomegranate flavor. I like the fruitier flavors. Um, I tried like a green one once. I think I've talked about this before, but it was just really gross. So... I just went to Verizon and um, as one does when they go to Verizon, I ended up having to get a new phone. So basically my camera and my speaker or my, yeah, it was like the speaker that was broken and uh, it was just, I feel like the people there are just so like, they just want to sell you stuff. And which makes sense because they're salespeople, but the guy was like, Oh, it's only this much a month, and then he was like, Oh, actually, it's this much, and oh, I forgot this. I don't know, it was just annoying. But I got a new phone, I had the 8 and I got the 11 Pro, so I'm really excited about that. I will vlog because I have to go pick it up. Um, because he's like setting it up for me and stuff. I really want to get the widgets app and like set up my widgets. Maybe I'll do like a what's on my iPhone and like show you guys my widget. But yeah, so that's what's going on. So I went to Verizon, it's like right there, and I was expecting to do like a cool montage and like come out with my new phone. But the iOS 14 update, he said it's gonna take like a couple hours. Which I don't know why, because I updated my 8 last night, and it took like probably 45 minutes. No, it took like 10 minutes. Maybe it's just because it's a new phone. So I have to come back soon. I'm going to go home and make lunch.